God, I love free shit. Four damn near brand new tires. I think they got 500 miles on them, something like that. Uh, my uncle gave them to me. Well, he gave them to us. We're going to put them on my dad's truck. Uh, what we've got to do is take the rims off and just put some old beat up skins on it so he can move the old truck around. And then these tires will go onto my dad's truck, which is outside. Absolutely free. I also got a muffler for free, pretty new. Uh, I'll use it either in the Granada or the or the Crown Vic, because neither one of those have exhausts. Uh, I gotta scrounge around for some shitty tires that hold air. <clears throat> and unfortunately, I know where one is. It's behind that massive shelf that we also got for free that I just put put up here which weighs a fucking ton, so I'm not going to move it. Maybe I can crawl underneath, behind it, and scrap that tire out there, but maybe not. I'm kind of lazy. Uh, I was moving everything around so I could get both these cars in here. <coughs> uh, did that uh, yesterday and the day before, cleaning up this side. And I went to fire up this one. Of course, the battery was dead. It had three volts because my brother's shitty radio he had in it so he ended up he's got a new radio for it it's not uh, completely uh, put in there yet but he'll get to that he came up yesterday and did a little bit of that <coughs> and of course my free parts washer it's working pretty good um, I've made a few changes to it I've got uh, a cordless drill in there now that had a bad battery and I've wired it up uh, to run off of a car battery and uh, got a little shorter uh, shaft there to spin the oil pump works pretty damn good all I gotta do is uh, plug it in here and flows all day long no problem but what, uh, what I have to do is I have to put a new uh, filter on the bottom of it because what I'm using is just this little a rag like this. And they're not very big, so they clog up pretty quick. Uh, as you can see, it's pretty porous, so it flows through fine. But I'm going to go ahead and find a pair of jeans and cut the leg off, an old pair, and use that as a filter because it's bigger so it should flow through fine and it's got a nice tight weave to it on a pair of jeans so it should filter better so once I find a pair of jeans I'll show you I'll show you how I do that all right I think I found a pair of jeans I'm willing to part with there's uh, holes everywhere and big old holes in your ass there so I won't be wearing that anytime soon and it's got one half decent pant leg so I'm going to go ahead and cut this pant leg off and then go in there and take the old rag off of that one put this one on and see how it works there we go I got the leg cut out um, I folded up the bottom part and I put these uh, little clamps on there that way if I ever need to clean it I can just take those off knock all the dirt out of this thing and put her back on uh, so now I gotta lift that up get underneath it and take the uh, rag out and go ahead and put that on there well there we go all done there's the old one pretty nasty and you know, it's pretty dark in there but the new one's in there so we'll go ahead and uh, fire it up and see how it works hopefully it'll flow enough Seems to be filtering all right. Yep, it's not filling up like the old one was. Oh, that just works dandy. I love it when stuff works out nice. And it was free. That's the best part. Free shit is awesome. <laughs>